everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've been here before. My name is Charmaine and I like to unbox subscription boxes, talk about books, do collabs because I'm in another one, do Mask Mondays. I'm so excited. Uh, if you're into any of that, please consider subscribing. I forgot what I was going to say. That's how it goes. <laughs> so today I'm doing a collab with Taylor Marie. She's actually been hanging out in my description box for like a month right now. I cut off the little thing in between here, but it's like a two piece mask. So I cut off the little thing like above my lips so I could talk, but I might end up losing the bottom because it feels kind of loose, just so you guys are aware. Um, so what we did is I know because Mary Catherine has done a lot of these Mass Mondays before where she answers questions and stuff like that. So one of the ones that she had was a Disney question one where she had done a collab with, I made notes, uh, Katie from Katie's Corner of the World and Gloria from Beauty after 50 who was formerly southern mama boys so they had done this collab where they asked like disney questions and taylor actually just went on a trip to to disney where she just got back so i was saying like we should do these ones because like she was just at disney so it was kind of a cool idea and it's my second collab and we're gonna do giveaways at the end as well all of the things i like <laughs> okay uh um if you don't know who taylor is she is she has like a small channel like I do as well. She does some hauls, she does some unboxings. She just got into a new place and she's gonna be doing like room tours and like decorating. And she does like uh, gift baskets and stuff like that. Like if you watch her channels, you can get ideas for that. So she's really, really cool. I honestly think that we would be like super good friends if we knew each other in real life. Like if we lived like really close to each other, we'd just be hanging out in her backyard having drinks all the time or something, or like barbecues or something. She's such a nice person and she's just very genuine. So I'm really, really excited to be doing this. Okay, let's get into the questions. Okay, so the first one is, would you rather sleep for a hundred years like Aurora from Sleeping Beauty or be sleepy like the dwarf from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs? So I don't like sleep. <laughs> I'm like one of the few people in the world who's like, sleep is not my favorite. <laughs> like, I honestly think that sleep is a waste of time. I'm not a good sleeper. I can't fall asleep good. I don't stay asleep good. I d like, I always feel just like I could be doing something else. I'm just, I'm just not a good sleeper. My boyfriend could sleep for like a week and he would love it, but I'm the opposite. So I guess I would go with like Sleepy from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs because I'm always kind of tired because I'm not a good sleeper. So that one would kind of suit. And yeah, I don't like sleep. So I think it's a, like a hundred years of sleep would be such a waste of time for me. <laughs> like Honestly, that's all I can think about. <laughs> What is it like? What do you guys think? Are you guys good sleepers? Like actually seriously tell me and how are you good sleepers? Like do you guys have like a thing that you do so you can fall asleep easy? Because I'm serious. 43 years old and I have not been a good sleeper my entire life. I don't think that's gonna get any better. I don't know. <laughs> Number two is would you rather read a book like Belle and Beauty and the Beast or be a cook in a restaurant like Tiana from The Princess and the Frog? So I like books. Just just you know just a little bit. <laughs> so I'd probably go with the book thing. However, I do love cooking. So that's also a thing. But I don't know if I could do it in a restaurant. Because I kind of get anxious like when I'm making my own recipes already. So I think a restaurant would be like just a little bit too much for me. Like I don't think I could handle doing it in a restaurant. But I would go with the book one then. Um, number three is, would you rather have a lightsaber like in Star Wars or a wand like Harry Potter? Definitely Harry Potter. Definitely, definitely Harry Potter. Like, yes, please, all of the magic. You could, like, float stuff to you. Like, yes, you could get your house to clean itself. Have you seen the Weasley house? That house is constantly cleaning itself. Heck yes, I am in for that. <laughs> Number four would be, uh, would you rather have your nose grow like Pinocchio or turn your mother into a bear like Merida from Brave? So I would do the nose grow one because I suck at lying. So I don't even try and lie because I'm not good at it. And pe like, I just giggle or like, honestly, I just giggle. <laughs> like, I'm not even joking. There's no, like, I'm like, I have a surprise. <laughs> and like, so I'm not good at that. I'm, I'm not good at surprises. I did throw my boyfriend like a surprise birthday party once. And honestly, it was all I could do to not tell him. Every time I started to tell him, I would sing like, da, da, da. 
da, 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 in my head so that my brain would like not tell him because it, it's very hard for me to keep her secret and it's like hard for me to lie. So I would definitely go with the Pinocchio one because I just don't lie and then I don't have to worry about it. Okay, number five is would you rather ride the teacups 10 times in a row or listen to a small world all after all? It's a small world after all all day long. I would go with It's a Small World After All All Day Long. I really really like that song. <laughs> I don't know. I think maybe it was my mom's like my, one of my mom's favorites. Hi mom I love you. I think it was um maybe my mom's favorite from when she was young or something like that. Like before I'd gone to Disney because my mom went to Disney when she was younger and I think that she told me about that. So I think it's been in my head for like a long time. So I'm okay. Oh, excuse me. I'm okay with having that song be in my head all day. That's fine. I can, that would be fine. Not that I wouldn't like the teacups. That would be okay. But just, I don't know. I would get probably sick of the same ride 10 times. I do like rides though. That's a hard one. I'm going to go with the, t the song still. Uh, number six is, would you rather eat an ice cream sundae or a snack on a fresh cinnamon churro? So I'm on lactose intolerant and I can't have chocolate. So the Sunday is out for me. I would go with the cinnamon churro, but I don't know what it is. Is it like a donut? Can you guys tell me? Like, tell me in the description box. I don't think I've ever heard of that. And it, I wrote it down funny because I didn't know what it was. So I wrote pretty much Cheerio, but I knew what it was like. Gonna, I knew what the thing was, what it sounded like. Um, number seven is, would you rather eat a poison apple like Snow White or Chris kiss a frog like Tiana in Princess and the Frog. Okay, I honestly love the Princess and the Frog movie. I would 100% kiss the frog. I like and hopefully he would turn into a prince. And that would be cool. But like, I would 100% kiss the frog. I love that movie so much. That is my movie that I watch when I'm not feeling good. Or if I've had like a bad day and I need something to cheer me up. Like that's the movie that I watch. I love, 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 love. The princess and the frog so i'm cool with kissing the frog just because tiana does it like i'm okay with that <laughs> so i'm going with that one uh number eight is would you rather have an enchanted fairy godmother like cinderella or a magic genie in a lamp like aladdin i think i would go with the fairy godmother i mean like the aladdin you get like three wishes so that would be kind of neat but what would you wish for i don't know it's really hard Maybe I guess the genie. If I could have three wishes, that would be cool. I could do some like good earth stuff. Like make the earth a better place. Or like wish away war or something like that. That would be okay. Okay, maybe I'm gonna go with Aladdin. I'm gonna go with Aladdin. Cause I could use the wishes for big things that would help the planet. So that would be cool. Then number nine is, would you rather be as sweet as Minnie Mouse or as beautiful as Snow White? I'm gonna go with Minnie Mouse. Uh, looks fade and I don't really care about that kind of stuff that I, I don't care but being sweet and being nice is good and if you're kind-hearted that's a good thing so I would rather go with the kind-hearted like nice and like just a joy to be around and helpful and cool stuff like that I would much rather like that and then number 10 is and this is the last question just so you guys know so like I think I'm rolling through these maybe I went a little too fast I don't know would you rather swim deep in the ocean with Ariel or fly high in the sky with Peter Pan? That's like an existential crisis question. <laughs> like, oh, I don't like the dark. I don't know, because I don't like the dark. So maybe the ocean wouldn't be good, but it would be really cool to be able to breathe down there. And like, honestly, I, I like really like mermaids and uh, the Little Mermaid is like one of my favorite, like Disney, like I saw it in the theater and everything. And I think that would be cool. But flying would be cool as well, because you could just go places really easy. Like you could just be like, oh, okay, well, I'm just gonna fly to Australia this weekend and go hang out in Australia. Like, I don't know. This is such a hard question. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I mean, I guess if this is the hardest thing I have to deal with all day, it's not that bad, right? I took the phone case off of the back of my phone so I can actually see myself in it. So I'm trying to make sure that the thing doesn't fall off because normally I just like stare at my camera and I or like look around the room, but I'm trying to make sure and I could see it falling there. Also, I got to do this more often because I can actually see myself in the camera. How have I not been doing that before? <laughs> like or in my phone, at least I can see what's going on. 
Oh, okay, okay, back to the question. Like the serious the serious stuff here. I'm gonna go with fly. I think flying is the one that yeah, I'm gonna go with fly. Cause it would be cool to fly places. Could you fly with other people? Yeah, because Peter Pan does, doesn't he? But he uses Tinkerbell. Would I get Tinkerbell in the deal? Like, this is a hard question. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna go with fly. That's what I'm going with. Okay, cool. <laughs> that was really hard. <laughs> I don't know why. So these questions did come from Mary Catherine Loves Cats, uh, Gloria, who's beauty after 50, and she was formerly Southern Mama Boys, and then Katie from Katie's Corner of the World. I'm going to put them down in the description box just so you guys can check them out. I will try and figure out how to like link their actual videos into the description box. But again, I'm not 100% great at this. As you guys know, I don't 100% know what's happening. But yeah, so I'm going to try and do that. And please go and check out Taylor. We are doing a collab together and I'm really excited because this is like my second collab and I got invited to a collab today, but it had like 14 to 16 people in it. And I think I'm just like not prepared for that yet. I've, this is only my second collab. <laughs> like, I don't know if I could hang out with like 14 to 16 people. That's like a lot of people. However, good luck to them and I hope it goes well because I know the one person who is talking to me about it is like super, super nice and I really, really like her. So I hope it goes well. That's very cool for them. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm giving for a giveaway. Oh, and my mask. This is the one that I'm wearing. It's the Glam Straight. I'm afraid to tip it upside down because some of this stuff is coming out. Hang on one sec. Let me find, oh, I got a tissue here. Okay. It's the Glam Straight one that I got from the um, FabFitFun and it's by SF and it's, you can leave it on for 20 minutes. It's two pieces. Like this part, that's why it's coming off because it's like two pieces. So you could just wear like the eye mask part or you could just wear like the chin part if you wanted. I like it and it smells kind of like strawberries. Like it's kind of nice. It's like maybe some like berry kind of thing. And it's like a light kind of thick. It's a light and thick mask. I don't know if that makes sense, but it feels very light on my face while it sits there, but it's a thicker mask. It's so nice. And I look so fancy. Like, look at me sitting around in gold. Hello. Yes, please. Okay. I'm going to show you guys what I'm giving away. So in this mask Monday, I tried to do different ones from my last one, but I only had, um, like two, two that are the same, I think. So we have this, one of the glam straight ones here for you guys to try, because I think that they're so nice. That was like my first bougie mask that I ever got. So I really, really like them. Then we have my figure, favorite one here, which is the collagen mask with the little piggy on it. I have like one more little piggy left and I'm so sad. I keep going to Marshall's to get it, but it's not there. Then I have a green tea essence one by the same company, but it has like a little plant thing on it. These are K beauty masks. Then I have a Crenshaw Shop one that is the Vitamin E face mask. It's this one. Looks nice. And then I'm putting in a foot mask this time. So this is a lavender oil moisturizing foot mask. So it has like little booties that you put around your feet after your feet are clean and it like moisturizes your feet. I thought that was kind of a neat idea to put something in that wasn't just like a face mask. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know how your day is going. Chat with me in the comments. Please like this video. Look at me remembering to say stuff once in a while. <laughs> Not very often. Not very often. Like, I've said it now this one time and I got like five other videos to film. So I'm pretty sure that that's the one time I'm going to be saying it. That's how it goes. Anyway, go check out my friend Taylor. She's awesome. You do. Oh, oh, see, this is the thing. I do the giveaway and then I get all excited. Okay, here we go. Giveaway rules are you must be publicly subscribed to myself and Taylor. You get an extra entry if you are subscribed on my Instagram. That's like in all of my giveaways. You must be 18 years old or older to enter. Once the package is mailed, I have no control over it. So if something happens or it get lost, I can't replace these items. But honestly, they're masks, so I would probably replace them. Um, this giveaway is not affiliated with YouTube. I have paid for all of this stuff myself. It's not affiliated with Instagram either, because I just realized that I talked about Instagram, but it's not on there either. Like, I honestly bought all this stuff myself. If there's custom fees, you will be responsible to pay them on your end. It's open to the US and Canada because Taylor's from the US. And if you unsubscribe after you like, if, if you don't win my giveaway and then you unsubscribe because you didn't win, you're not going to be able to enter any of my other giveaways because I just want to keep it for the people who are on my channel. Okay, that's it. 
Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you think about this bougie mask. Let me know what your favorite Disney movie is. Like, actually tell me that. Because I honestly, I was like, okay, The Princess is my, The Frog is my favorite. But before that, it was like The Little Mermaid or Beauty and the Beast, because I could never pick between those two. But now I've seen Encanto like a hundred times. I am like obsessed with Encanto. Like, I'm going to watch it this afternoon. It's so good. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think. Have you guys seen Encanto yet? Please like this video if you do. Look at me saying it twice in a video. Man, I'm doing good today. This is a good day. Okay, I'll see you guys soon. Thank you so much for spending a couple of minutes with, with me. Wow. Thank you, thank you so much for being here today and spending a couple of minutes of your day with me. I really, really appreciate that. And I really, really appreciate you. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.